Our two estate vineyards have a long and storied history. Sanford and Benedict Vineyard was planted originally in 1972. It was the first planting of Pinot Noir and Chardonnay in the Santa Rita Hills. La Rinconada Vineyard was planted in 1997. Both of our state vineyards are located on the southern bank of the San Inez River. It's a magical place. There's an incredible amount of nature. You know, all around the vineyard we have our mature forests and grasslands, and we're on a daily basis seeing wildlife in and around the vineyard, which is wonderful. Our vineyard soils have a large proportion of gravels and rock, both of that weathered shale and then also a jagged, angular, very hard type of chert. The amount of rock and gravel that we have in these soils really lends itself well to growing healthy vines. This vineyard has a lot to teach us with the history of our own rooted vines. It's a great window into what viticulture in California used to be, but also gives us ideas for the future of viticulture and what it could be in California. The Santa Rita Hills AVA is this really beautiful area located on the central coast of California and very close proximity to the ocean. The Santa Rita Hills AVA itself is kind of sandwiched in between two sets of hills that run east and west. So the valley runs and kind of opens up on the Pacific Ocean side. So you have this really perfect marine influence, the cool breezes running through the valley into the hills and cooling down the grapes in the morning and also at night. This creates the perfect conditions for growing Pinot Noir at Sanford and Benedict and Chardonnay at La Rinconada Vineyard.